I'm Mr. Grinler, and here are my creatures. And welcome back to another episode of Mr. Grinler's Creatures, but on today's episode we are doing a rehouse for a centipede. So you guys will remember months and months and months back, Craig posted a photo on there, I think it was on Facebook, of a centipede on top of his head. And that is a video that I'm going to be showing you today. And then at the end of this video, maybe towards the end, I'm going to be showing you a picture of when Craig actually got bitten by this centipede as well. So I know a lot of you have been waiting patiently for this video and uh, Craig was going to put it on his old channel, but unfortunately he's not doing YouTube anymore. So yeah, he's kindly given me the footage to edit up. And uh, yeah, I'm going to release it on this channel, which you're watching right now. So let's go back in time and let's have a look at some of this footage. So here we are. We're just about to start. Jaden's gathering some footage of the centipede itself. It was in a prime spot. It looked like just a mess, I'm sorry. <laughs> it was in a prime spot just over here and it did a runner and hid under there. So I have to work out how I'm going to do this. So have a look at Craig here. He has no idea what's about to come. That happy face. Well, yeah, just keep watching. So this should be fun. And then there's me. I do not look like I'm about to have some fun. If I'm honest, I'm absolutely petrified of centipedes. And then we got Sean, who's also holding the camera. She's right by the door. She's ready to go. But I guess me and Sean don't really have to worry about that because it's Craig that's going to be doing this rehouse. And uh, yeah, he's not getting any help from us. <laughs> Scariest thing is we know that this thing can get out of this enclosure. <laughs> so, how do I want to do you want to cry? How the f*** do you get a centipede out of a tank? Oh, me. See, I know for a fact that Ben is going to be laughing at me doing this. I hope he is, because this is my first time doing it, and anyone do not go into doing that something you've not really done with an animal before with confidence like it's not gonna come at you and hurt you because it might well hurt you. <laughs> I'm not saying this is gonna be terrible. Apparently the venom from these isn't the worst. The bite itself hurts. And as time has gone on, I'm pretty sure that Craig knows what it feels like now, but we'll talk about that a bit later on in this video. So yeah, I'm very cautious, very cautious, probably overly cautious if I'm honest. So now, let's have a closer look at some of the footage of this centipede.
I'm Mr. Grinler, and someone needs to get me out of here. Nah, f that man. This might work out for in our benefit. What the? F No, 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 no because if I touch it, there is a reasonable chance it's going to bite somewhere on me and I don't want to risk that. Apparently they're like slugs. I do not believe that is true because slugs don't do this. <laughs> right, so this has happened. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not too sure how to proceed because I can't see where this centipede is. Centipede. <laughs> do you want to take this? You want me to take it? All right. <laughs> yeah. Just moving it. I can't. I can't see it. Oh my god, oh. dude! I. Oh, I feel so sick. I don't know why. Because it's not even on my head. That is a You're literally freaking the anxiety, fuck out. Because it's just. It's alright. It's peed. I'm alright because it's on Craig and it's not on me. So. Same stories forever, isn't it, Jaden? Right. So <laughs> that's one of his things, isn't it? Is that where they bite at the bottom end? No, no. That's it's like extra beak claws. Oh. Do I just put my head in the tank? Honest question, like serious question. <laughs> I don't question. know what you're meant to do. I think you should let me and Jaden stand near that door so that if we need to I run, we can. Both man up.
Holy shit. <laughs> now that was something else. I haven't put the lid on yet. It's just now digging in. Oh my god, I never thought I never thought that I would do that. I've had this 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 animal for well over a year now and oh my god, I don't even know how to, to start to describe what was that what that was like. Yeah, because it's not like it even went straight to your hands, is it? It They're just went straight. So powerful. Like the the grip is something else and it's so like intense because it's like needles just jabbing into you. I'm gonna put this lid on. So that is all the footage from that rehouse. And um, we don't actually even have that centipede anymore. So going on to when Craig got bitten, he actually sold the centipede to someone and when he was trying to pack it up, it sort of came out of its enclosure. I'm absolutely gutted I didn't record this if I'm honest, because uh, I was just in shock. I was just like, what what, what is going on? Like absolutely what is going on? I, I didn't know what to do if I'm honest. But Craig being Craig, he put his hand down and it just all of a sudden happened so quick, it just went up his arm. And then it went on to his back and uh, I was just like, oh my God. I was like, Craig, I, I was like, I don't know what to do. I was like, I can't help you. Like literally, I cannot help you with a centipede. It is just absolutely freaky. And then the next minute, I know it's just, it's, it's dug its head down into his uh, like skin. And I was just like, I was like, Craig, I was like, I think you're getting bitten right now. And uh, yeah, it was, it was absolute carnage. So I'll show you the picture right now. And as you can see, that's the bite right there, and it just looked absolutely grim, if I'm honest. And I put something around it, because uh, I just wanted to see if the swelling was going to get bigger. And uh, luckily it didn't, but he was in pain for, I think, up to about a week. I think it was about a week, week and a half. And uh, yeah, I was actually pretty worried about him, if I'm honest, because uh, I've, I've never seen him like that. If, I, <laughs> if I'm quite honest, it was, yeah, it was quite freaky. But thank you very much for watching today's video, guys. I know it's a bit of a different one. And, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm never having a centipede again in my life. That centipede is gone. Um, never having one again in my collection. That's that's it. That's final. Uh, he's put me off centipedes for life. So if you could like, comment, and share, that would be absolutely great. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and hit that bell icon so you're notified of when I upload next. Don't forget, guys, I've got Patreon now. Five different tiers. So if you want to help and support the channel, there's a link down in the description. But Mr. Grindler's done it. So are my creatures. So are my Balfouris. I'll see you next week, guys. Have a great one. You all deserve it. Peace.